for today.、Um, this book I'm going to、um, show to you.、Um, it's like a textbook. Its its layout is a typical textbook for the high school or the first year university、um, undergrad. So this book simply it's called Entrepreneurship, and in it I'm going to share with you two chapters that I thought is it shall be quite interesting、um, for you. And、uh, looking at this layout, it's actually、um, uh, designed for the student,、uh, and it's and textbooks like this are usually very useful for working professional adults too. If they want to get some inspiration, some ideas, because they're so well laid out, they've got to be very、um, the layout. The layout's got to be very、um, uh, organized in its respective. Chapters is very clear,、um, and you can actually find the information in pictorial forms. Now let's take a look at the chapters.、Um, I'm going to talk a little bit about、um, entrepreneurship. Is entrepreneurship right for you?、Um, that's something I am going to talk about、um, or read about in this book. And then the next thing is. I also want to talk about、um, chapter three.、Uh, should you run an existing business, or you should you own a franchise or start a business? So there you have it.、Um, these are some of the、um, advantages of uh, uh, entrepreneurship. You can actually think out of the box, think of a totally new idea to to address a problem. In the community, address a problem、um, or solve a problem in the economy、um, in an innovative way.、Um, you can disrupt an economy. You can disrupt an industry with an innovative method, an innovative app, an innovative idea, an innovative model. But traditionally, you can actually run an existing business by buying over a business. Or or entering into a family business, or if you don't have a family business, you can actually buy someone's someone else's invention or an invented product. Or the next easiest thing is own a franchise. All right. Now these are the two things I'm going to talk about.、Um, how do you start a business?、Um, the form of a, a business、uh, entry, either running、um, an existing business. Or、um, buying a franchise.、Um, I won't. I won't talk about starting a business with innovative ideas because that's a whole lot of、um, information. I'm just going to talk about three point one, three point two, and、um, whether entrepreneurship is for you. Now let's go inside. Let's go to chapter one. Is entrepreneurship right for you? What is an entrepreneur, right? Entrepreneur are people who own, operate, and take the risk of a business venture. Call are called entrepreneurs. They are engaged in entrepreneurship, the process of running a business of one's own. Entrepreneurs come from all types of backgrounds and create all kinds of businesses. People of all ages choose to become entrepreneurs. Some own tiny craft shops, while others own large construction companies, etc., etc. Entrepreneurs try to identify an unmet need or unmet needs in the marketplace. Then, they provide a service or product to meet those needs. Well, this is most important. Entrepreneurs must identify the unmet needs in the marketplace. Which means that they are un- identifying a niche,、um, an opportunity, and that's most important. And you don't want to be、uh, one of the masses. And then they provide a service or a product to meet those needs. Now let's take a look at、um, employees versus entrepreneurs. Entrepreneurs assume risk. This makes them different from employees, who are people who work for someone else. 
Both may make decisions, but only the entrepreneur is directly affected by the consequences of those decisions. All right. So um, this book lays it up so simply um, for anyone to pick it up to, for an idea, for an inspiration, and these are the types of entrepreneurial business. And of course, um, this book is a traditional. It talks about traditional entrepreneurship. It doesn't talk about e entrepreneur. Um, and an e entrepreneur will have its business online, and of course, there's a hybrid of a uh, business which is, which is, um, which is online, plus um, a traditional brick and mortar business.